Welcome, 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 so family, this is Queen here, back again with another general intuitive message for the collective. Hope everyone's having a wonderful day, a wonderful evening, whatever time it is, and your place in the world. Okay, we're going to see what message the spirit has for us. Remember to take what resonates and to leave what does not. Know that energy is fluid. It, it could be either masculine or feminine, so please reverse the roles when necessary. Also, time is fluid. We could be picking up on past, present, or future energies. I want to give a shout out to my blue crystal babies, to my indigo children, to all of you. I send love and high vibrations your way. Thanks for the support, the love you show the channel. If this is your first time here, welcome, welcome, welcome to my loyal subscribers. Thank you, and I love you for all the support you show the channel. That being said, let's tap right in. What do we have for advanced spirit for the collective? What do they need to know? What do they need to be aware of? Divine spirit, please and thank you. What's your spirit? What do they need to know? Okay. Hmm. Let me get these arranged here. Wow. Okay. Collective. Hmm. Somebody's feeling insecure here. Okay, something isn't happening here. Okay. Somebody was supposed to take the lead on something and, and probably be successful at something here, but maybe they didn't receive something they were expecting or something here. Okay, in a partnership. Could be in a union. Could be in a business partnership or something like that here. But this was something that they were... Um, just starting out to do, okay? Well, I'm, I'm hearing take the lead, take the lead, okay? Take the lead. But somebody didn't want you to have some sort of victory here, okay? And I'm saying it's with a partnership, either in a commitment or a business partnership. So let's tap um, in a little deeper and see what this is, okay? Because something wasn't fulfilled, okay? And it's leaving somebody feeling insecure here, all right? What's your divine spirit? Let's get a few out of here. Hmm. What do they need to know, Spirit? What do they need to know? What do they need to know? Please and thank you. Why does somebody want somebody to fail at something here? Not succeed at something here? Wanted somebody to feel insecure here, okay? Something they set out to do. Something they decided to do. Yeah, somebody didn't want this to happen for them here. Somebody didn't want them to receive something here, receive some sort of victory in a partnership. Why is this here, Holy Spirit? Something they were looking forward to. Making, leaving somebody feeling insecure. Yeah. This is somebody who doesn't compare to you, collective, okay? And they know it, okay? Yeah, they try to do this to you. Yeah. This person tried to make it seem like you had a serious problem, but in true reality, they have a serious problem, okay? Uh, wanting to see you fail at this partnership, um, whatever this is, okay? Um, yeah, whatever this is, this could have been avoided. So I'm getting that somebody um, did something to stop you from receiving something, okay? St stopped you from having some type of victory, all right? Um, hmm. Something that you hope for would happen for you in a partnership or something like that, or in a relationship, something that you were looking forward to. Um, <clears throat> give, yeah, somebody showed the shady side here. Yeah. And they got busted here, okay? But all of this could have been avoided, okay? But there's somebody here that's really um, criminal-minded <laughs> in your energy here, okay? That did something to keep you from having this victory here. Or didn't want to see you have this victory here. Yeah, didn't want to see you receive a victory here. Wow, something that you were looking forward to is what I'm getting here. So they wanted you to feel insecure here. What's here, spirit? What do they need to know? What do they need to know? Yeah, this person tried to make it seem like you had some type of serious problem or something like that. Okay, yeah, you may have been losing sleep and, and couldn't rest, okay? Because this person was trying to, um, I mean, you were looking forward to this victory. Okay, could have had you restless, you know, like, wow, you could have been losing sleep, trying to make sure this happened for you or whatever. Yeah. Somebody started following you, stalking you, or something like that here. Okay, a criminal-minded person here. Okay. 
They wanted you to, um, well, this person showed the shady side here. All right. Hmm. Maybe this person has a serious problem. This is what Spirit said. Yeah, this person doesn't compare to you, collective, whoever this is. Okay, this is a person that hates your energy here. All right, this is a person that didn't want to see you be victorious in something here. Wow, they didn't want to see you take the, the role here. Whatever this role is, okay? Yeah, I'm going to things got messy, okay? Or they wanted things to get messy because it came out in the reverse. They wanted things to get messy for you to feel insecure here. Tell us more, Spirit. Yeah, they wanted you to lose sleep, you know? They couldn't rest. This person's been following you and stalking you to make sure that you didn't get this victory here. Wow, in this partnership or this relationship here. Wow something you were looking forward to here okay wow what else is here tell us more about this person spirit please and thank you hmm. we have a uh, yeah somebody betrayed somebody for the last time okay that's what you said to this criminal minded person that they betrayed you for the last time this person doesn't compare to you and they know it okay so they do um shady stuff okay they're gonna get busted for doing whatever shady thing that that, that they're doing to keep you from um, having this uh, victory here, okay? Yeah. Maybe um, you were waiting for a call from someone or whatever, um, and then you got a call. It was bad news or something. Some type of communication, some type of call here. Yeah. And somebody betrayed you for the last time. This could have been a, in a business relationship or a partnership here. Okay. Wow. Some type of relationship here. Okay. And you wanted a victory with someone or something here. Somebody didn't want this to happen for you. Whatever they did, this criminal-minded person, it could have been avoided here. Okay? They wanted things to get messy. Okay? But they're going to show their shady side here. And they're going to get busted here. Okay? This person's also been following and stalking you. Okay? Wow. This person couldn't wait for you to get some bad news here. All right? To receive some bad news here. Wow. About whatever this thing is that you're ambitious about. I don't know if it's a business partnership or a relationship here. Let's see. A spicy encounter okay maybe uh, you and this person may have had words okay this person has been following you and stalking you or whatever they wanted things to get messy they wanted uh, but it didn't happen that way but this is what they wanted they wanted it to be one hell of an experience for you here is what I'm getting here Wow hmm this could be somebody that you're not focused on anymore okay this could you know like be an ex or something like that or ex-partner okay or somebody you're in a uh, relationship with here what else is here spirit yeah somebody played you for the last time you, you feel they betrayed you for the last time and somebody played you for the last time here okay whoever this person is they don't compare it to you and they know it okay wow i'm getting here that they may want to apologize because they couldn't mess this up for you whoever you are okay but their apology is unaccepted here all right we have um who are they to you okay so maybe you um this is somebody who tried to come in between a relationship with you and your person here okay and they were trying to cause all kinds of um um problems for you to keep you from having this relationship with your with your person or to keep you from being in a partnership with someone here okay wow maybe you're asking this person who are you like yeah there was a spicy encounter or there may be a spicy encounter this is past present or future energy okay yeah you may be telling this person to keep that drama away from you okay because I'm, I'm getting you don't get down like that okay yeah this may have hurt you but you couldn't show it here okay wow somebody betrayed you in some type of way here somebody tried to play you but they played you for the last time is what I hear you say okay you don't know who this person is but this person um, was talking you watching you following you okay they wanted things to get messy for you okay this person is very shady uh, very criminal minded here okay they have a serious problem here all right wow you want them to keep the drama away from you you don't even know who this person is but they want they want to say some choice words to you about something here they wanted you to not receive something here on a partnership or relationship what else is here spirit please and thank you what do they need to know what do they need to know What do they need to know? What do they need to know? Whoa, that's so many spirit. Yeah, whatever they did, they it, it could have hurt you, but you didn't show it. Yeah, sleeping with a narcissist. 
maybe you found out that your person was sleeping with a narcissist here okay maybe you figured out you were sleeping with a narcissist here and maybe whoever they were um messing around with um there could be a spicy encounter between you two and you may be asking this person who are you okay because you don't know this person or maybe you're letting your person know that they betrayed you for the last time they played you for the last time okay well this is this is going to be weighing on your heart to find out that you've been sleeping with a narcissist okay weighing on your mind weighing on your heart yeah this hurt you but you couldn't show it here okay you just want them to keep the drama away from you okay yeah the bottom of the deck it says i never expected this to happen okay yeah i never expected this to happen somebody's feeling really insecure now here okay well let's see here what do we have here holy spirit what message do you have for this person that got betrayed by their person okay in this relationship or this partnership here okay yeah somebody got a call with some bad news or something um probably from somebody with a spicy encounter maybe somebody called somebody's phone and had some choice words for them or whatever this is somebody who's been stalking you okay you don't know who they are all right they have a serious problem okay whatever this is could have been avoided if your person hadn't been so shady if your person hadn't betrayed you if your person hadn't played you okay i hear you saying that your person betrayed you for the last time they played you for the last time you've been sleeping with a narcissist here what's your spirit what do they need to know what do they need to know about this karmic energy here holy spirit what do they need to know out the love light and truth what do they need to know spirit What's here if you haven't already hit that like share and subscribe button please take the time out to go ahead and do that now i deeply appreciate it wow what do we have here spirit this is this isn't over between us i'm coming back for you so yeah this person um this narcissist that you were dealing with okay the one that you were sleeping with yeah the one that's been weighing heavy on your heart and your mind here has been um with someone else here okay someone that's been following you and stalking you here yeah this person know that they hurt themselves by letting you go all right hmm yeah but see this person has a serious problem and so does the person that they uh were cheating on you with here they have a serious problem because they wanted to have a spicy encounter with you or something like that here okay but you want them to keep the drama away from you and this is what you told your person keep that drama away from me i'm not down with that okay well now your person is feeling lost they don't know what to do okay maybe this this uh karmic has contacted you okay and you don't know anything about this uh third party or something like that you you know wow this is one hell of an experience okay they wanted something to be messy here but yeah you saw, saw the shady side of your person you realize you've been sleeping with a narcissist here okay yeah they're busted because whoever this karmic is they were messing with has a serious problem okay this all could have been avoided okay if your person had been totally honest with you here okay yeah wow maybe um yeah this is weighing on your heart whoever you are okay that this person did you this way okay wow See, I've never experienced this intense connection before. Yeah, this is one hell of, hell of an experience, okay, for, for, for some of you, okay, whoever this message is for. Yeah, you never went through anything like this before, and you don't like it, okay? Wow. <clears throat> Somebody says, I'm afraid of hurting you, okay? I'm afraid of hurting you, okay? Because, yeah, you don't want you don't want the drama, um, you want the drama to, to, to stay away from you because I'm hearing that you're not going to take nothing from nobody here, okay? You're not going to take nothing, I mean... I'm hearing that you will defend yourself. Like, you're not afraid or nothing like that. But you're not going to take any mess. But you don't want any drama. Period. Okay? Yeah. But your person is mad. Okay? Upset at themselves. Not at you. Okay? Yeah. They want they, they want to tell you that they love you so much no matter what. Okay? But they played you. Let's not forget that. They played you for the last time is what you're saying here. Okay? They, they, they want to say now that you're so beautiful inside and out. Right, they're gonna tell you uh, whatever you want to hear right now, okay? Well, because they're busted, this is what I'm getting here. They're busted, okay? Because whoever um, this karmic is that they were dealing with, femme masculine, yeah, they didn't want to see um, you and your person be together, okay? They wanted something to fall apart, they didn't want you to receive this love, okay? This love offering from this person, okay? Wow, or this partnership with this person here, okay? Wow, what else is here? This is something that you were looking forward to or uh, whatever okay wow hmm it didn't work out yeah 
all I'm thinking about right now is how attracted to you I am. Well, of course, yeah, they, they see how beautiful you are now, inside and out. All right, now that they're busted, this is what Spirit said. Now they're busted, okay? Wow. Hmm. Wow. Yeah, you want them to just keep this drama away from you. You don't know who this person is, this karmic is, that's calling your phone, that's trying to contact you, that's following you, stalking you. Okay, yeah, you feel like all this could have been avoided if your person had not been such a narcissist, okay? And you, you figured out you were sleeping with a narcissist, and this is weighing on your heart here, okay? Yeah, you're going to put yourself first here right now, okay? You're going to put yourself first here by keeping that drama away from you. Okay, you want them to keep all that drama away from you. You don't need nobody following you or nothing like that, okay? Wow. You don't need nobody um, uh, stalking you or causing you any problems because your person wants to be a narcissist, okay? Your person wants to sleep with a narcissist, okay? Thank you, Spirit. Yeah, you're not even willing to accept their apology. Yeah. This person may come to you, you know, like there's somebody you could trust now or something. Your, 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 um, your narcissist, the person that you were sleeping with here. Once they get busted, or if they haven't already gotten busted, yeah, they're saying they're working on themselves so they can come back. And they want you to wait for them, right? But you're putting yourself first right now, collective, okay? Wow. You're setting yourself apart from this person here, okay? Because what they've done to you is weighing down on your heart, weighing down on your mind here. You just want to keep that drama away from you, okay? Damn, you didn't know you were sleeping with a narcissist. Wow. You're not accepting this person's apology. Okay, you don't know who this karmic is that's uh, been following you. All right? Wow. You didn't know that your person had a shady side. Okay, but they're busted. Okay, they're busted because somebody tried to come in between this relationship, this karmic did, to try to break things up. I don't know exactly what they did, but yeah, you never expected this to happen. Now you're feeling um, insecure with this person, and um, you're not accepting their apology right now is what I'm getting here. What's your spirit? Tell us more. What do we need to know? Okay. We have, there's no one else thinking about you all day. Yeah, this is what your uh, person um, wants you to believe. That it's all, all about you now. Okay. Yeah. But you're not accepting their apology. Okay. Yeah, they want you to, you know, know that they feel empty inside without you. Okay. They'll say anything once they're busted. Okay. But now that you see their shady side. Wow. Hmm. And that you've been sleeping with a narcissist. You don't know who they are anymore. Okay. And with somebody calling you, stalking you, you know, um, trying to cause you some serious problems, trying to, you know, just get in there and break up the relationship or the partnership, you're not, you're not willing to deal with that, okay? You, you never expected nothing like this to happen with you and this person here that you were dealing with. Okay, now you're feeling insecure, okay? This person wants you to know that they love you so much, but, you know, they keep running from you and they don't understand why they do this, okay? This is a confused person. Somebody that's in mental conflict. Somebody that's not ready to settle down is what I'm getting here. Wow. Somebody's not ready to settle down, or they wasn't ready to settle down, and they got involved with a third party, and the third party wanted to cause some trouble with you. Yeah. Yeah, you think that this person is better off without you. Okay. Yeah, they need to go about their business is what I hear. Okay, because they're still trying to gaslight you, telling you all these good things that they, they know you want to hear, or whatever. But this is weighing heavy on your heart, and heavy on your mind here, um, that you've actually been sleeping with a narcissist. Like, this is the first time this has ever happened to you. All right? Yeah, but this all could have been avoided here. And now there's a serious problem here. Okay. Wow. Hmm. Yeah. You may have a child with this person. This is not even supposed to be in here. But yeah, you may have a child with this person. Okay. Um, or you may have to take care of a child. Or wow. Hmm. Responsibilities here. So this you and this person, there may be some responsibilities between you and this person here. Okay. Well, and this is the way you never expected this to happen. Okay, now you feel insecure in this whole relationship. Okay, this whole partnership, you feel insecure. Okay, you feel like you're better off without, you know, being away from this person because you don't like drama. You don't like the drama. Yeah, but this person wants to tell you that they're so in love with you, that you're so perfect for them. But yeah, and that, that, that they're secretly obsessed with you. Yeah, and they never expected to fall in love here. What else is here, spirit? But I, I'm getting that there's some responsibilities in this relationship. Maybe some children or a child. Or something um maybe some well maybe they were helping you emotionally or something like that here wow yeah we both need to heal okay maybe if your person's saying they're hurt they're trying to call you on the phone or contact you or something like that you're not ready to accept their apology for what they did um i'm getting that they slept around with someone else and this other person um really tried to get in and uh, put a uh 
some a separation in between you and your person here. Um, somebody didn't want to see you and your person have a, a victorious relationship or a victorious um, partnership here. Okay. Yeah. Hmm. Wow. What else is here, Spirit? This is something that you were looking forward to. You know, like you were looking forward to a beautiful, well, a beautiful relationship. Yeah. Your person wants to say they're sorry for messing everything up here. Okay. They don't understand why they did it. You know, because they know you didn't deserve what they did to you. Okay. Hmm. Yeah. Maybe this person had walked away from you first. And then um, you found out they were cheating because you started receiving phone calls, harassment. You know, things like that. Yeah. Your person couldn't come, come fully honest with you about what they've been doing behind the scenes here with someone else here. Okay. And you're finally realizing that you've been sleeping with a narcissist here. And this is weighing heavy on your mind and your heart. Okay. Well. Yeah, this person wants you to know um, that they will always be um, here for you. Whoever this is that did you wrong here, I know what you mean to me, and I'm ready to be with only you now. Okay, yeah, that's because they got busted. Okay, you realized the shady side. You realized that you were sleeping with the narcissist here. Okay, thank you, spirit. Yeah, yeah, you're learning a spiritual lesson here that you don't have to, uh, you know, deal with this person, okay? Wow, you want to keep all that drama away from you. All right, you don't even know who this person is that keeps trying to contact you about your person who's trying to come in between you and your person's relationship or partnership. Okay? Wow, but your partner is still hoping that in the future you guys could be together. But they feel so guilty about um, the action that they took and, and what they said to you. Okay, so they may have said something to you. They may have communicated something to you. Okay? Wow. This, only, this person only hurt themselves by doing what they did to you. They hurt themselves, okay? And now they're lost and they don't know what to do. Wow. Mm -hmm. They don't want it to be over, you know? They say they're coming back for you, but yeah, they know they messed up everything and you deserve so much more. Yeah, this person was scared to be honest with you. Wow. Mm -hmm. Whoever they got with, um, they don't compare to you. Um, and they know it, whoever this karmic is. Yeah, this person um, that you were dealing with, no, they hurt you. They don't want to hurt you again. They're feeling guilty right now. Be only because they got busted, okay? You've seen the shady side of this person that you realizing now that you've been sleeping with a narcissist, okay? And this is unsettling to you here, all right? You, you're you looking at your person like, I don't even know who you are. Like, you know, how could you do this? I, you never expected this to happen. You feel so insecure, whoever you are, okay? Yeah, your person wants to tell you that they're sorry for messing everything up, okay? Well... They're feeling lost and they don't know what to do. But yeah, you seen the shady side of this person. Yeah, they got busted. You know, you're gonna bust them with the karmic or you know, um or you're going to be busting them with the karmic here. Is what I'm getting here. What else is here? Something's been weighing heavy on your heart, on your mind here, collective, about this connection. Alright. Maybe you find out that your person um, let you go or, you know, created some type of argument or disagreement, you know, um, just to slip out and cheat on you for a minute here. Okay, well, but they got busted here. Or they're going to get busted. All right. It says, please be patient because I'm afraid of commitments. Yes, your person was still in, the, in you know, player vibe mode, you know. They still want to be a player. Now they're screaming they don't want to be a player no more. Wow. Huh. They don't want to be a player no more because now you realize they have a shady side. Yeah. And they got busted because this third party karmic started contacting you. And you're, you're not down with the drama. Okay. You don't have to fight for anybody. That's what I hear you say. I'm not going to fight for anybody. You know, if you're meant for me, you're meant for me. I should, you, we shouldn't even be in a situation like this, you know. So, yeah, you never experienced something like this before. And you're not down with drama. Nothing like that. Yeah. You feel like you're, this person is, you know better off without you they're not ready to commit you know they're afraid of commitment you're realizing that yeah that this person's just a narcissist here you're not willing to take this relationship any further is what i'm getting here okay you're feeling secure about the relationship now okay even though you, you guys may have share some responsibilities okay yeah this hurts you but you couldn't show it okay you're not accepting this person's apology right now this person betrays you for the last time so i'm getting that you may have you know had some type of uh Intuitive feeling that your person messed around before. Yeah, because see, your person can't, can't, they're afraid of commitments, okay? Wow. But they may have children with you or a child with you or something like that for some of you. 
Okay, yeah, but they betrayed you for the last time. I don't know if they betrayed you before um, as in cheating or something, but this time you're not accepting their apology here. You're not accepting the apology, okay? You're realizing that you're sleeping with a narcissist and or you have been sleeping with a narcissist and this person that you were dealing with is simply afraid of commitments. That's why they go out and cheat. Okay, but this time they're getting busted. You've seen their shady side for the last time is what I'm getting here. What else is here, spirit? Hmm. What else would you like for them to know? Yeah, you never expected this to happen. Wow. Yeah, this is in the reverse. I hope to have a future with you one day. This person knows that they don't really mean what they say here. Okay. Yeah, things move so fast. And I didn't know how to trust my feelings for you. Yeah, see, this person is not ready for commitment. And now that you've seen the shady side of this, this person, um, that they're a narcissist, okay, that they sleep around, that they would cheat on you and bring drama towards you for no reason, have people stalking you for no reason, have people calling and harassing you for no reason. Yeah, you have to let this person go here. Um, you're willing to let this person go. Okay, you're willing to uh, move on. All right? Yeah. This person may call you and tell you that they miss your conversations and they miss the sound of your voice or whatever. But, you know, just no spirit said that they, this person um, is afraid of commitments here, okay? They will continue to betray you. They will um, continue to play you because they're not ready here. They're simply not ready um, for a partnership or relationship here, okay? They have player vibes here, all right? They know they mess things up, okay? They know they that you deserve better. Okay, but still they still want to tell you things like this because maybe you guys have a child together, you have children together here, okay, and they want to keep coming back, coming back and coming back in your energy, um, but never changing, okay, and some of you are just simply tired of this, okay, back and forth shit, okay, you're not down with this type of drama here, all right, you're not going to deal with it, you're not used, you're not used to it, I hide my true desires for you here, yeah, yeah, this hurts you, but you couldn't show it, okay, because maybe you did love this person here. Okay, but they showed you who they truly were here, is what I'm getting here. Yeah, I, I have never loved anyone the way that I love you. Yeah, because you truly desired this person, but it hurts you to, to, to know that they cheated on you. Okay, and to have somebody try to start some drama with you because of something your person did, and they had this karmic coming towards you to want to start drama with you. You're like, who who are you? I don't even know you. Like, you know, don't bother me. I'm not down with the drama. Keep Keep all that drama away from me. Yeah. This uh, person that you are dealing with, they need to own up to where they feel sure about their relationship here, okay? Because they're not, they need to tell you the truth that they're not really ready for a commitment here, okay? Wow. But the thought of you just drives this person crazy here, okay? Well, they, uh, they want you and they want to be a player too is what I'm getting here. What else is here, Spirit? Yeah. They think they can come back into your energy, okay? But you're not down with the drama. You want that drama to stay away from you. Yeah, this hurts you, but you couldn't show it, okay? They know that no other compares to you, okay? And not even this karma that they were dealing with, okay? They don't compare it to you, all right, at all here, okay? Also, your person is criminal-minded, all right? They're very confused. They're criminal-minded, too, okay? Well, and they betrayed you, and they played you, okay? Well... Um, they don't want it to be over because they want to come back to, 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 to try to betray you and play you again. Is what Spirit said. Mm. Wow. This person is pretending to be lost. Okay. Like I said, they're criminal minded. They pretend like they don't know what to do. All right. Hmm. Well, they're not struggling. That's what Spirit said. They're not struggling with revealing their feelings because they don't have any. This person is, uh, is um has no emotions. Okay. Wow, this person can't figure out if they love you or not. That's what I'm getting here. Okay, Spirit doesn't want you um, to be confused like this person is. Okay, this person's really confused. Okay, to where you really don't know who this person is. You've been sleeping with a narcissist is what I get here. Yeah, this person doesn't want to take care of you. Okay, yeah, but you may have taken care of this person here because it's in the reverse here. Okay, yeah. But you was you was willing to help this person, but you're not willing to take in any of this drama or you know anybody harassing you behind a relationship or a partnership with this person here. Okay, yeah, other people are interfering and trying to control um, your relationship here. Okay, well, yeah, you, you can do without the drama. You want that to stay away from you. Yeah, you never expected something like this to happen. Yeah, somebody took something too far this time. Okay, wow, yeah, your person took something too far this time. You're just simply letting them go here. One more spirit, please, and thank you.
What do they need to know? Yeah, you, you figured out you've been sticking with a narcissist here. No matter who I'm with, my thoughts will always lead me back to you. Yeah, yeah, this is what Spirit is saying. No matter who this person is with, meaning they're still going to continue to be with people. They're still going to continue to betray you. They're still going to continue to betray you if you allow this to happen. This person is criminal-minded when it comes to relationships. They don't know how to commit, okay? Um, they're going to always think they can come back to you, okay? Wow. Hmm. But you don't know who this person is anymore, okay? Because they did you. They betrayed you for the last time. They betrayed you for the last time I'm here. They played you for the last time. Okay, yeah, this has been weighing on your heart. This has been weighing heavy on your mind collective. Okay, you, you're better off without this person. Okay, this is what you're telling yourself. Okay, you don't know who they are anymore. Okay, the, the, you never expected this to happen. Whatever happened was, you know, something that was very unfair to you. Very unfair to you is what I'm hearing. Okay, like I said, this person may um, have children with you. You guys may have some type of responsibility together, something like that. Okay, well... You may think that you need this person emotionally, but yeah, they know that they sabotage the connection. You know, they want to tell you that they regret it. Yeah. Hmm. This person wants you to know that they still love you and, and they can't stop um, thinking about you. Yeah. But yeah, this person changed on you. They're not the same. They're not the same when you guys started out. Okay. Wow. Hmm. This person is emotionless here is what I'm getting here. Yeah, they were self and immature here. Okay. Yeah. But apologies are accepted here. This is what they want to tell you. Okay. Well, I never want to see you again. You hurt me. <laughs> this is what you're telling this person. This is how you really feel because it's, it's, this is weighing on your heart here. I never want to see you. Okay. Because you hurt me. I never expected this to happen. You feel very insecure with this person. This person has betrayed you for the last time. Okay. Wow. This person wants to come back into your energy to continue to gaslight you. Okay. Because they're not ready, Spirit said. They're not ready for a relationship. Okay. They're not ready. Anything else here, Spirit? Anything else? Would you like for the collective to know, to be aware of about them sleeping with a, a narcissist or finding out that they've been sleeping with a narcissist? Okay. You may be hurt. Okay. Yeah. You may really love this person, but... You're seeing this person for who they truly are. You're seeing their shady side here. Okay. Oh, wow. Especially when this karmic start calling you. This third party karmic start calling, um, stalking and harassing you here. If they haven't, they're going to. Okay. Yeah, your person is also criminal minded. They're not only a narcissist, they're criminal minded too as well. Okay. Whosoever energy this is, I'm picking up on. Wow. I'm going to take what resonates and leave what does not. Okay. For masculine. Wow. This could be either feminine or uh, masculine energy here. It says, I hope our paths will cross again in the future. Yeah. You're not looking back because this is in the reverse here. You never want to see this person again. They hurt you. Okay. Yeah, this person was very selfish and immature. Okay. <clears throat> this person really doesn't care if you forgive them or not. That's what Spirit said. They just want to come back in and get in your energy to betray you again because and play you again in some type of way because this person is not committed. Okay. This person lacks the emotion of love here. All right. Wow. This person can wear a mask really well here is what I'm getting here. Yeah. You know you need to let this person go. All right. This person know they need to let you go because they know the true reason why they're there. Okay. Yeah. No one makes me feel the way you do. You're the best I ever had. Yeah. This is that gaslighting energy here. Yeah. You were hurt. You know. Collective. You were hurt. Look at what this person did to you here. You feel very insecure. Wow. Maybe this happened pretty fast here. Yeah. Wow. Maybe this is something that happened fast. Maybe you found out about um, your person cheating. Um, rather fast this time, more so than the last time for some of you. Because this is not your person's uh, first time cheating for some of you here. Okay, this time you're not accepting the apology here. Okay, anything else here? Mm. Our connection is complicated. There are issues out of our control. So, yeah, you're not willing to go back um, to this person here. Yeah, we're not willing to go back to this person. Okay, yeah, this person hurt you. 
okay you want them to keep all that drama away from you okay you don't even know who you were sleeping with like you're saying i was sleeping with a narcissist somebody that cheated on me somebody who um told me the things that they know i wanted to hear but they know that they wasn't gonna hold their their themselves responsible to what they said here because they're non-committal here is what i'm getting here they know that whoever the karmic is they got with the third party they got with um they don't compare it to you feel masculine and they know it okay your person's just somebody who you know who's going to continue to be uh, criminal minded when it comes to relationships or partnerships here okay they're going to continue to to hurt you if you allow it to happen okay wow i mean for some of you like you feel like you never want to love anyone again right now but yeah no just just know that you and this person that you were connected with did not have a spiritual connection and that's why it didn't work out thank you spirit that's why it was never going to work out because uh, this person's mind is not right here their heart's not right their heart wasn't in it okay they still have clear vibes here okay for masculine they still have clear vibes they may come from that's for forgiveness here but this person has to do um some some self-reflecting they have to go inside and see why they are unable to love why they are unable to commit okay why do they constantly um betray uh, people when they get in relationships or play people okay when they get in relationships especially when they got with you because you didn't deserve it okay well you're in a space now that you know it's weighing on your heart and mine's so heavy what this person did to you because this is something you didn't expect okay it has you feeling very insecure okay because that's in the reverse here okay that you have to deal with your pain and be able to open your heart to love again like i said some of y'all is not even wanting to be in relationships uh, right now because of what this person um did to you okay and you know maybe you think it's better that you and this person separate or stay separated okay wow that's what i'm getting here wow okay yeah this hurt you but you couldn't show it okay whoever you are but it's okay because you will prevail you know love always supersedes all okay love is never a failure as long as you were doing the right thing oh okay and your heart was in the right right place in the right space and then you'll be fine it's just this person that lacks emotions okay the person that you were dealing with lacks emotions okay they lack um commitment and because it's something that they have to deal with um something that they feel short or not you okay this is some um something that they're responsible for okay it's their own soul salvation is what i'm hearing here okay this person needs to be delivered from whatever has been holding them back uh, spiritually okay and unable to love um uh, fairly uh, to another here is what i'm getting here okay and spirit said maybe you guys are uh, better off separated here okay wow just to keep the drama away from you this is what i'm getting the energy i'm picking up on that you know yeah this person hurt you but you're not going to show it okay but you feel it you feel it all right but you can still move on you can still move on because you know you did nothing wrong here all right and you never expected this to happen you know to find out that you were sleeping with a narcissist you know that you were sleeping with somebody um that you may have a family with or a child with or whatever and they were going out betraying you um playing you and sleeping around with a karmic that decided they wanted to harass you as well okay wow you never expected this to happen but yeah you're making a hard head over heart decision here um you're choosing to walk away you, you you're telling your person that you know maybe you guys are better off separated and maybe some of you done that already okay and kudos to you if you have okay because this person that you're dealing with has a lot of growing up to do okay they are very immature in spirit okay they are very immature when it comes to love okay and yeah they have some growing to do here right they have to learn a spiritual lesson here okay and until they learn you're not gonna be ready to love here okay so yeah yeah you guys are better off separated okay this connection is complicated um for some of you because you do have a child with this person but the issues of um within the relationship are just so out of control you're not willing to deal with it you're not willing to um deal with the drama you just want all that stuff to stay away from you and i don't blame you okay even the person that they dealt with um doesn't compare to you okay and they know this okay well but your person still chose to betray you they still uh, chose to play you okay well and their apology is not accepted here is what i'm getting here all right this person could not be honest with you okay well and this person's definitely afraid of commitments okay so maybe you are better off separated from this person all right that's what spirit said okay wow you're making a head over heart decision here all right and you're going to choose the best decision all right you never expected this to happen right to be living a toxic lifestyle with this person here okay wow mm -hmm. 
maybe this person felt like, you know, they wanted to communicate to you that you were always too busy for them um, and that you were not focused on them anymore. And that's, that this gave them um, a reason to go out and cheat. But no, this person just likes living a toxic lifestyle. And you're not down with that drama. Okay. Yeah. You never expected nothing like this to happen. You know, for something to have you feeling insecure or whatever. Yeah. Hmm. You just wanted things to be practical. All right. Yeah. But you're not willing to, to go back to this person. To go back to this toxic lifestyle, okay? With this narcissist that you found out you were sleeping with, okay? You found out the shady side about this person, and you're letting this person go, all right? You don't want a toxic lifestyle, all right? Well, you want something that's practical, you know? Well, just somebody to love you and love you back. You want it reciprocated. An equal give and take. Here's what I'm, I'm picking up here, okay? You don't want somebody that's going to betray you or, or play you or whatever, you know? And you have to hide your feelings, like, you know, not show your hurt, not show your pain. Okay, wow. You don't have to deal with this spirit said, okay? Yeah, you don't have to deal with feeling insecure, all right? With this person here. You're making a head over hard decision is what I'm getting here. Wow. Some of you really did love this person, yeah. Some of you feel like you fell in love with this person too quickly, okay? Yeah, wow. Jump right into a toxic lifestyle with this person, and yeah, now you wanted them to keep all the drama and conflict away from you. Yeah, and I don't blame you. Making a head over heart decision here. You're making the right choice. Okay, the choice is still yours though, but I'm just saying, okay, this person is not committal here, all right? Like I said, they may have a responsibility with you, but yeah. Hmm. This connection is complicated, and there are issues that are out of your control. You cannot make this person do the right thing. Okay, they have to choose to do the right thing on their own. They have a lot of spiritual growing to do here, all right? And until they learn how to love and accept what love is, and know what love is they're not going to be able to reciprocate that to you and you've come to that um understanding here is the energy i'm getting here okay all right i'm going to end the message there i hope this helps someone all right just keep the faith keep moving forward you know stay strong and you know keep believing in yourself and, and keep loving okay never let nobody um dim your light here keep shining keep shining bright you a star all right till next time namaste for now